Hello and uh, welcome to uh, today's session. Uh, we are now uh, in uh, a new training facility in Shusha next to the cross country stadium. Together with two of the athletes from the Norwegian um, national team, uh, recruit, recruit team, um, cross country skiers. And my name is Mikko Kokslien. I'm a former Nordic combined athlete. Uh, competed, in, competed until uh, 2018 and uh, now I work for uh, Olympia Toppen uh, in the region of Inland, uh, the area around Lillehammer. Um, I've been working here now for one and a half years. I have um, a lot to do with uh, para-athletes in our region um, and uh, today we will have a basic uh, strength uh, session. We will do some mobility, some core, um, and also try to uh, challenge the balance a little bit with the, the pillows, uh, balance pillow. Uh, if you don't have a balance pillow, uh, as uh, they asked you yesterday, you can maybe have a, a normal uh, couch pillow or something that unstabilizes uh, where you are sitting. So hopefully you will have now a um, set of elastic um, huh? elastic rubber band. Um, you can also maybe use a scarf or something like that, or even a stick will work. Um, and hopefully you also have a, a ball, a medicine ball, which we call it in Norway. Uh, it's um, yeah, I think you have two, three, four kilos, yeah. or um, you can also use the manuals. Um, so just have it close to you and we will try to make this session as good as possible. Um, and also for uh, adapting the what we will do, I'm sure that many of you are used to uh, yeah, adapting to the different uh, sets that we are going to do. So. We have a pretty simple uh, line of, uh, of the workout we're going to do now, so hopefully you are able to join. Uh, so now, ladies and gentlemen, let's go. Let's, go. let's start with some uh, mobility. On the back, so, or on the side actually, if you, you can tilt on the side, uh, either you can have your leg as a support um, and we will do just a crossover with the arms like this slow movements and try to get a good stretch on the way down you can hold for a second or two when you're down Du kan godt kjøre sånn helt over nå, ikke den, nei altså den, at du kjører, nei at du kjører rett, that you do like that, ja. Yeah. Good, you can do eight, eight times to one side and then switch over. Very good. Are you used to doing this kind of exercise? Yeah, every day. Every day. So uh, I usually have uh, one session uh, a week with Indira, who is living now in Lillehammer. And the goal with the session is to 
uh, yeah, uh, prevent injuries, strengthen the shoulder um, core for a better performance on the tracks. Like, are you done? Good. Then we can. Um, you can take the the rubber band. Um, and here it's uh, you can, yeah, you can choose how tight you want it. Uh, the goal is that we have some. If we need to push out a little bit so it's you can feel it a bit in the shoulders and then straighten up good posture yeah. here also work all the time with the the stomach and the, so we keep a good straight back. Top feet of empty. Four, four more. Small break. How long will you have a camp now? Sunday? Yeah. We have uh, nice uh, skiing conditions uh, right outside here. So I guess you will be skiing a lot. Yeah. That's good. I have to apologize the the English if it's not all perfect, but I'll, I'm doing my best. <laughs> okay, we'll take one more, the same. Controlled movements. OK, small break. What can the clock in there? How was it? Heavy? Yeah. <laughs> OK, then we will have a um, um, bit the same. We used the uh, rubber band. Tighten up here, and then we do a tilt to the side. And here, try to tilt as long as you can by holding, holding back. So it's not just a, like a touch down, but you try to tilt and use use the side muscles to stay up. Can do six to each side and then small break. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> six to yeah. OK, 
Okay. Small break again, and we will do the same one more time. As I told before also that it's important that you try to keep up, keep up before you go down. This can be a very easy, easy one if you just go down like this, but if you try to tilt your whole body and really feel that the side muscles are working. Yeah. Okay, one more. Do eight to each side now. Do we have uh, attendance from uh, how many nations? 24? 24 nations. That's, that's good. Bra. Okay, good. Uh, do you think you are able to use the handles to do the... Yeah. We told everyone to bring socks, but we we forgot ourselves here in Norway, so we have to do some adaption. But uh, if you have... Uh, if you now, we can give you a bit time to bring out um, the socks or I don't know what you sliding mats. I actually have something here I can use. Uh, Think of that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, you can also use the, uh, is it handles? No. Yeah. So the goal here is now also sit up straight and tilt to the side. Oh, yeah. <laughs> push, push downwards to get yourself up again. So go as far as you are able, push down, try to have a straight, straight arms all the way and really push down to get yourself up. This is also a, one that can be easy if you just tilt yourself up, but if you go down and really push down to get up, you can, you should feel it up here and on the sides. I think we can do eight to each side. Now you can take uh, yeah, one to the right and one to the left. Yeah. Push down. Good. Brand it up. Good job. How many you got now? <laughs> <laughs> don't know. I think it's, it's okay. We have a break. How many skiing sessions have you had this year? 
Okay. We're on train camp in Creasewood. Yeah. And then I've been here last weekend, but it was not that good. No. <sighs> we have a, had a late winter in uh, in Lillehammer this year. It's, uh, yeah. I think we have uh, used to have much snow by this time, but this year it's, we have artificial snow here in the stadium, which is good, but otherwise it's not so good. Okay, one more. It's enough with six to each side. Really feel that you push down when you are going up. Oh, I can get it. Okay. Good. Then we will have, you can find your medicine bowl. Um, if you don't have this kind of bowl, if you have something that weighs around two, three kilos, it's okay. Uh, even a weight or a weight manual or Something else will also do the do the job. So now we're going to here as well, important, sit up tight. We will do up, down to 90 degrees, out and down. Up, down here. And we'll do eight. Go to that Yeah. Try slow moments. Good. Yeah. Do you have the count? Okay, good. And you have somebody who can count for you, Indira. <laughs> okay, small break and we will do one more. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> okay, one more. Eight.
it up. Good. Did you follow the the digital camp yesterday? Nej, om det var på den campen, alltså. Ja, ja. Ja. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And you started the physical camp today. Like, yeah. What's the program? Is there a program tonight on the camp? What's tonight? Yeah. Nutrition with the uh, Will then Camilla? Yeah. Good. Okay, then we can uh, you can straighten out the mat if um, we'll do some on the back. <laughs> and I'm not sure what this is called in English, but we will do as a Kroma Sveida lying on the back so you can you can also have your legs like this if you're able or else straight and we will what we want to do here is create a, a space between and then do a crunch try to use only the lower part of the stomach to feel a crunch in the lowest part of the stomach. Funker den? Er det greit? Ja. Men du får krunsje litt. Ja. Ja. So if you're not able to do a like this, then you can at least try to put on a crunch the lowest part of the stomach. Får du den til å ta? Du kjenner den når du... Ja. Du er 12, 12 av dem. Og fokus på... Really fokus på å få en god crunch. Når du har 12, da må vi ta en minutt break. Yeah. Um, I can also say that uh, many of the things we are doing today is, um, yeah, this is like the basic uh, line. We are used to use a bit more uh, equipment to make it yeah, more adaptive to the sport that we use, but uh, I think for this session it's I think it's the best to keep it basic. I know probably many of you don't have the access to all the equipment that we would be preferable to use, but um, yeah. So just for your information, we normally we use a bit more. We can use a boosy ball or also uses to use the rubber bands a bit more with um, maybe like we are going to do some sit-ups. But um, yeah, then we, for many, I, I think that will be a crunch, but which is also good. But there you can also adapt by using rubber bands to the to the wall and, and different um, yeah accessories to to help the the training a bit more. Okay, ready for twelve more. Try to work a little bit in the sway and then do a good crunch.
Okay, good. And then we will have um, some break from the. And we will uh, can do on the on the stomach. We will do some sets of um, of different push-ups. So we will have three. Um, we start with. Uh, we can go up here and then down to the side side. <laughs> yeah, we can try to do five on each uh, each arm. Yeah. Okay, break. Hard? Huh? Yeah. So it's a quite hard one. We will do um, one. I think we can take uh, 10. We do wide. So we normal uh, push up. Do. Nej, jag sa inte helt lite längre in. Du svimmer. <laughs> We have an old swimmer here, so. You can do 12, 10, 12. And then we do as um, yeah, small, what a tight, narrow um, here as possible. Um, and we go. And if and then yeah, you can try to take eight or ten here. <laughs> so you can uh, adapt how narrow you can have your arms. Bra. Bra. Kom Bra. Okay. Then we can we do we have a small break. Um, we will do the same round again one more time before we go over to some uh, sit-ups and then we will do challenge the balance a bit at the, yeah, the rest of the session. So whenever you are ready to have one more go, so we do that to the side uh, five, six times per uh, arm and then the wide grip and then the narrow. Bra. Don't need that. <laughs> can have a small break, but uh, we can take a bigger break after you're done with the sets. Yeah, 10 plus minus. Yeah, and then the narrow. Try a little smaller. Huh? Yeah. 
done. Yep. Um, you can now, uh, if you if you could move a bit closer to the um, to the wall, and this is also for you back home. If we will first do some sit-ups or crunches, uh, but then I want to do some um, yeah um, ball throwing <laughs> to the wall. Uh, if you have somebody at home, uh, or if you have a possibility to throw the ball at a wall, it's okay. But and also if you have somebody that can catch it. And give it back to you will work otherwise i can show you an alternative but now first we will do crunches sit-ups um but i think that they can go bort to vegan so what you how many should we take we can do uh, two times 15 to 20 and also depending on yeah, how many you can take then around 15. And try to feel that the lower part of the back is always on the floor. Yeah, push the lo lower back to the floor all the time. Can you feel it? Yep, good. Känn att korsryggen pushar ner det där. Pressen. Man har det nå. Ok, break. So also, I have to say it's a bit unnatural for us to speak English together. So, <laughs> different setup from what we're used to in our daily training, but it's okay. I think it's going well. Yeah, you ready? Take 15, uh, around 15. You can adapt it to your own level also back home. Yeah. Okay, then you can um, a ball cast into the egg, also one day is on seed level of ice. No, we tar uh, put it up. This uh, go to fint, or that? Yeah, there. So here you can, uh, if you have a pillow back home, you can uh, use it and sit um, on it. Uh, indeed, um, maybe we wait. Yeah, and you can take without. So the goal here is to sit here, and then if you have somebody, as I told you, to catch the ball uh, would be good if you don't have a wall to throw it. Otherwise, you can do like this. So preferably like this. Otherwise, do it from side to side. Try to tilt as long back as you are able to. Um, can also be a good idea to have if you are, have something to hold your feet if you are doing like this. But um, if you have something to throw against, then we do that. We take 15 throws on the side. OK, let's go. Try to get a good movement in the whole upper body. Uh, 
And uh, the goal with uh, having the pillows underneath is to yeah, stimulate the, the balance a bit or challenge the balance a bit more. Um, and also get it a bit more like uh, the activity that we are doing uh, um, out on sitting on the, like this, sitting on the, what is kjerke på engelsk? Sitski? Yeah, so we're trying to, that's the goal with the balance pillows, which we will also use after we have done two sets of this. Okay, let's go. I also forgot if you don't have a ball, you can use the manuals as on the from side to side on this one. Do one more round of this. You can have a small break in between. Haven't you brought any drink? Don't you have any? <laughs> huh? <laughs> you should always have some something to drink during a session. So <laughs> okay. What is it? Fifteen more. No. <laughs> Job. Okay, good. Then we, uh, indeed, you can also bring your balance pillow. Let's see, I should have a manual. I can't get out of one of them. Can we just set it up? So uh, now we will try and challenge uh, the balance. Um, we have these kind of uh, pillows. Uh, I'm pretty sure that not all of you have those. So I hope you have something that can make the ground a bit more unstable. Uh, we will start with uh, using some sort of weight um, yeah we use the manual and we will do up and up here also it's important to keep a solid and compact posture yeah Enter, yeah, I can do Yeah, I can just. <laughs> you have some shoulder problems? Okay. Thank you. Yep. But if it's not wound, so... 
Bra. Bra en dyra. Den er fine bedre den den som er litt mindre. Det Bra. Bra en dyra. Ok, small break. Så so her is also really important to have full focus when you are doing this um, exercise. Um, the goal is to have, yeah, to build a capacity of uh, like balance in the in the sit ski. Um, have you used this kind of exercises a lot before? Um, more now. Yeah, because you used to be a swimmer. Yeah. yeah. So, and uh, how do you feel it? Do you feel some effect? So it's uh, also for Indira, who has been uh, training here in Lillehammer, was really hard to sit on the on this in the beginning, but I can you can tell big difference now than before, or I can see I, I can see a big difference. So it's uh, I think this is a good exercise to yeah to do to be more ready for the challenges that uh, comes in the. Yeah, on a on a track in a sit ski, for example. <laughs> okay, we can now uh, you can have the you can take the medicine ball. We do a different uh, variant. So pretty much the same, but now I want you to rotate. Try to have. Pretty straight arms. It's okay if they are a bit bent, but not in here, but that you go a bit out. Bra. Ska ha det en egentlig litt lettere. Ja. Bruk uh, to kilo, sånn der da. You can also use something else than a... Bra. Bra en dyra. Det var litt greier å gjøre det på den her enn i dag tidlig. Ja. <laughs> ok. Så so, ja, yeah, basketball will do the trick also, but ja, uh, yeah, we would like to have some a bit heavier ball than a, a basketball. But, for the start, definitely, it's uh, it's enough with also having without weight. Will you have a manly ball? I mean, uh, it's okay now. Take a break. So when we do these kind of exercises, it's also important to have breaks um, and that you are able to be fully focused when you when you are. Um, yeah, doing the exercise. <laughs> okay, I think we take one more with the ball. Same. Try to be compact in the lower part of the stomach. Yeah. Yeah. Bra. Ok, small break. Good. Ah. 
Ajá. Ja. Men det kan jo gå an imellom, da. Men hvis det er liksom... Ja. Ja, så so uh, we're asking if they should sit on the pillow in between. Um, if it's easier to stay on the pillow, then yeah, stay on the pillow. But if it's costing a lot to just be sitting there, then you can maybe go off in between. Okay, um, one more with the with the ball. This is also a fun exercise you can do. Um, yeah, you can throw tennis balls. You can throw different kind of balls to each other uh, if you are a pair. Um, You can also use the wall um, to throw balls if you're alone. Um, yeah. OK, then you can go off now a bit. We will go back on it, but I think it's good to have a small break from the pillow. We will do uh, one more um, variant uh, of this uh, with the balance pillow. Huh? Yeah. Um, where we will use, uh, I think we will try to use this. Um, if you have something uh, that you can lift up, uh, sit here, start from down there. Go up, down, and down, down. Okay. You can do six uh, on uh, each arm. You can turn up and ned, and so on, and so ned on the side. Och så andra. Så där. Ja. And all the time be ready in the six on each side. Okay, good break. We will do this once more and then we'll be done with this today's session. One more round. Same. Good focus now on the last one. Bra. Good. Bye-bye.
Ja. Hvor kjenner dere den? Abs. Abs. <laughs> Bit shoulders? No. Okay. Yeah. Good. Um, then we have uh, come to an end to this session. What do you think of the session? Very good. <laughs> what do, why is um, these sessions important, do you think? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Hmm. Hurt, uh, do you know? Yeah. Okay. So, but uh, I think um, also, as I told, that we usually we m maybe use a bit more uh, call it tools to to have a bit more. Um, yeah. A bit more. Um, I like the, the movements that we do outside, but I think for for a session without the, too much uh, equipment, I think um, we got to do quite a bit today. Um, it's a lot about core and the abs, um, and also try and get stability, um, and also having a bit mobility in the beginning. I think it's um, important to. Yeah, at least for uh, for you who are uh, in a sit ski, it's a, a lot of uh, movement on the upper body, so I think it's important to open up. Um, and um, as you mentioned, that um, for preventing injuries, um, these kind of sessions may, might not be the ones that are the heaviest, but uh, I think um, maybe one of the most important ones. So. Um, I hope you enjoyed the session. Um, if it was a bit hard to follow, then at least I hope you got some inspiration for um, for sessions um, that you can do. Uh, you can do at home. Uh, I guess many of you did some of it at home uh, today. Um, also, in the um, yeah, in the spring when the COVID uh, Corona came here, we had um, also online. Uh, online training sessions, um, which I think worked out uh, quite well. So you are able to do a lot of these things also at home. So then uh, thanks for uh, joining. Uh, I'll be, uh, yeah, not seeing you maybe, but